Now less than three weeks away from the March primary election, a Cook County judge has ruled Donald Trump is disqualified from running in Illinois for violating Section 3 of the 14th Amendment. Judge Tracy Porter then put her order on hold until Friday in anticipation of an immediate appeal by Trump's attorneys. Porter's ruling reverses last month's decision by the Illinois Board of Elections to keep Trump's name on the ballot after a group of Illinois voters accused the former president of engaging in insurrection leading to the January 6th Capitol riot. Tonight, I spoke with Fox 32 political analyst Stephen Caliendo about the impact on next month's primary. What this ruling essentially says is that Donald Trump himself uh, is not fit for office, cannot serve office, and therefore could not be on the ballot uh, in Illinois to run for office. But technically, when we vote in the primaries in Illinois, we're not voting for the presidential candidate. We're voting for electors who pledge to those candidates to go to the na respective national conventions and cast their ballots. Now, of course, today's ruling becomes moot if the U.S. Supreme Court rules against the state of Colorado, which decided to remove Trump from the ballot ahead of their primary this coming Tuesday.